Hey guys, it's Kim here. Um, I am just waiting for my day plotters to come in the mail. But first, I will do a little shopping haul that I went to pick up today. My uncle kind of just snuck out for a little bit. So I'm going to try and film this as best as I can. Um, as you guys are kind of like on my iPad and I'm turned to you guys a different way. So anyways, I went to Sobeys, which is actually like Safeway kind of. I can't remember if Sobe owns Safeway or Safeway owns Sobeys now. I can't remember that's It's a Canadian company. I believe I can't remember so if anyone's in Canada and knows Exactly what is what please let me know and people keep messaging me anyways, so uh, Since I went vegan, I've been trying to figure out where else I'm gonna get my protein from and I do have a plant-based protein powder downstairs where I do uh, where my bedroom is and everything but I'm not a fan of the flavor or the taste right now so I did get this one today it's the brand Vega one all-in-one shake it is in the flavor coconut almond um, there is 20 grams of protein and so on and so forth so that's I just got the smaller container I wish it did come a little bit I could have got a little bit maybe half that size to try but this is actually a lot smaller than the bigger sized one so I got this kind to try um there if I one scoop there's 160 calories there's five grams of fat there's 0.5 grams starch, um, there's 0 grams omega-6, there's um, 1.5 grams of omega-3s, uh, cholesterol there's 0 grams, for sodium there's 240 milligrams of salt, which, you know, that's not too, too bad, but I do retain fluid in my calves with if I have too much salt, so... Uh, potassium, there's 220 milligrams, carbohydrates, 10 grams, fiber, 6 grams, and sugar, 1 gram, and then protein, of course, 20 grams. So, yeah, since I went vegan, I'm going to try another um, vegan protein. The one I have downstairs is from the company uh, EHP Labs, I think it is. It's the blessed uh plant-based protein um i got that in the salted caramel which it's good it's just i haven't figured out if i'll use that one more for smoothies than shakes this one it kind of tells you how exactly to like do it in a shake or a smoothie or bake with it so that's kind of why i went with this one um also what i'm gonna be trying I also got the little containers of this one. Um, the Vega Sport Hydrator. And okay, you guys, sorry for um, cutting you off. Uh, I am going to finish. My uncle shut the office door, so I'm going to try and talk a little bit quiet. Um, you will hear my movie in the background. Um, so, as I was saying, I um, got the Vega one all-in-one shake and the flavor coconut almond. So, I'll show you guys that again. Um, but now, I am, got the Vega Sport electrolyte hydrator. Um, it is zero calories. And... This is in the flavor lemon lime, so it is gluten free, it is plant based, so that's what it looks like. I did get the small container of it, so I just want to try it, and if I like it, I will, rep I will purchase the bigger container, but when I went to get it, there was no big container, so this might be the only size I can get. In this one, I'm not too sure. I only saw this and then little packets. So, I'll have to look around for a bigger size of this if I do like it. So, um, I did get in the flavor of lemon lime. Uh, I believe there was another flavor. I think it was very berry. 
I would have to double check, but that's the hydrator. I am going to try in a plant-based, and then I also got the Vega Spore Sugar-Free Energizer. So this is a pre-workout, and it is an SIE berry. So this comes in a bigger container as well and has packets. So of course, if I travel, I will want the packets. And um, yeah, so this is, I feel like I'm getting pimples or something. But yeah, this is another thing I want to try because I want to see my energizers and recoveries that I do have, they're not plant-based. So since I am vegan, I gotta try and find some plant-based uh, hydrators and energizers. So I'm gonna try this today and the hydrator. Um, just give me one minute and I'll grab my protein bars that I'm gonna try. There are a few, but I got two of the same kind, and then there's uh, one, the sport ones, I only got one of each. So, uh, this is the Vega Chocolate Peanut Butter Cup. It is going free, so it's that, and then there is only 200 calories, so course sometimes I don't like to eat breakfast so this is just really good um, to have at 6 in the morning when I work so that's always good and of course I got two of that flavor um this other one is a is also by the brand Vega it is a protein plus snack bar so it is in the flavor chocolate caramel so there is 11 grams of protein in this one, so that's that, and I got that, and then the first one I showed you guys, I should actually tell you how much protein is in this one, there is 5 grams of protein in this one, so those two are done, and then I also got chocolate peanut butter, uh, it is a all-in-one meal, so it is a substitute bar, and this one has 13 grams of protein, and it is 270 calories, so that's, that's that one. I did get two of that flavor as well. Um, also the Vega Sport, um, it is also a protein bar, there is 15 grams of protein in this one. It is also 250 calories, and it is in the flavor chocolate coconut, so that is uh, another one. And then I also got it in chocolate peanut butter, also the Vega Sport, the protein bar, which is 15 grams. And this one is 260, so this one is only... 10 more calories than this one than the chocolate coconut one so you know i am going to try them and i've tried a lot of protein bars but um i need to find another way to get all my protein since i cut out meat i cut out dairy i cut out everything so anyways once my um once my day planners show up I will film that unboxing and I'll kind of, I'll be um, putting all of them together because this video is going to be one video. So um, once I get that filmed, I will, um, I will be editing and having it up tonight. Plus I have another video, but of course, as you guys can see, I'm kind of like going to, write down what I want to have in my description and then the links and then this is for the second video I have to film tonight because I had some on one of my videos a um, person commented and wanted me to do a updated video of what it's like to be I wrote her questions down so uh, 
what's a good vegan salad dressing how is my vegan journey going and then what being vegan is all about like the pros the cons and why i chose to cut out meat and dairy so that is the second video i will be doing today so anyways i hope my uncle will go away for a little bit <laughs> he usually goes to see my grandma so we'll see how much video I can do and I gotta wax my eyebrows I haven't waxed them in like months so <laughs> <coughs> yeah anyways I will talk to you guys later and I will hopefully have my day planners by this afternoon it's only 11 13 right now so anyways I will edit the other videos together and then when I get my day planner I day planners I will do that unboxing and then add it to this video so I am not even gonna close this video off till I do my unboxing so anyways I'm gonna stop right here <laughs> okay you guys I'm back um I just actually saw that my day planners got delivered so let's get into the unboxing so well this is actually really heavy Anyways, Erin Condren's box. I'm just gonna cover up my address, you guys. No, wait. Yeah, that would be my address right there. So, yeah, the box comes like that. And then it says enjoy. So, um, this is my old one that I've got in, back in April. So, I don't really like it. I don't really, um, I have it in the horizontal, which it's a little bit harder for me to plan my workouts. So anyways, I'll unbox this and actually open it. Show you guys which one's actually for uh, my personal use and then which one's for business, like for me, where I'm gonna plan all my videos and stuff and all my posts on my social media. Um, of course, I'm talking quiet again. So, because um, I don't really want my uncle to hear me and everything I'm just gonna put those scissors there and I'll bring the box back kind of move over the pens and stuff because I've been doing some work flip it open and at the top I see this um, forget the mistakes September the remember the lessons so it's kind of like a postcard so and then of course there's another one that says enjoy and then it says to and from and then of course it looks like that so we're gonna try and open this nicely and i'm already wrecking the nice wrapping paper um, you get a little sticker that says enjoy Okay, so we get some bubble wrap. So the first one that's gonna be coming out is my personal one. So this is my personal one. I actually designed, like, I put the um, hashtag girl boss, hashtag um, travel bug, and then my name, and then I chose the colors that I wanted. So I really just personalized this whole thing. And then the back looks like that. And I got my personal one in the horizontal in the color. So I, my very first Erin Condren day planner was the horizontal uh, layout. So I'm very impressed with how easy it was to plan. I don't have my old one, but I got this one for my personal because I can use the bottom part. Like what I used to do was go the top was like to do's across the week and then here was like cleans or like you know laundry or little daily things and then down here I would do like workouts and fitness and like everything so and then I would do my uh, weekly goals so you know I found like this helped this layout helps me a lot more oopsies my ruler decided to pop off and I got the rose gold of course um, down here and of course every 
um, the planner comes with this little book, so I got that. So that's one of my, that's my personal one, and then my uh, business one. It says she designed a, light, a life she loved. So I also picked the colors for this one. And I think there's that, and there might be another one in here. Yeah, there is another little thing there. And this one I got in the hourly layout, but also I got it in the neutral color, so it's not colored. It's just neutral. And I am not liking how that is turning. Yeah, anyways, the hourly layout is actually like that. So, yeah. This one will be more business planning and everything. So more YouTube, more stuff. So yeah, I can't wait to use these today. They're planning. Uh, it'll be different. Planning two different day planners. Anyways, yeah. So that's that. And uh, these little things come with it too. Um, I don't really use them, so I guess they're good if you travel. So, anyways, when I travel, I'll have to take two day planners with me now, but that's okay. So I could actually start planning in August, but I would have to jump all the way to this week, or should I start planning next week in this day planner? No. I'll start doing this week because we're only on Tuesday so it really doesn't matter when I start it oh and I usually like in my other one there is like a little box right here I would write like weekly quotes so I'm looking forward to that but I am going to take this protective film off of these rulers I think they just like, she puts them on there just so that they don't get wrecked. That's like kind of like a bookmark if you want. And I'll do it with this one as well. Um, so yeah, I will be starting to plan them both today, actually. Anyways, I will let you guys go. Bye.